What's up guys, welcome to this video and today I'm going to show you some of the new features and improvements of the recently released iOS 7 beta 4 running on my iPad 3. And the first thing which you notice in the lock screen is the new animation. Uh, it's, you know, this, uh, it's glowing text on the slide to unlock uh, text and with it you have an arrow indicating uh, or emphasizing the slide to unlock area which was previously missing in the other versions of iOS 7. Now this animation looks uh, pretty similar to that of uh, iOS 6 and out here also you have a small uh, indication where, which allows you to swipe up the control center uh, uh, it's pretty, and this is the control center right here and you can swipe that back in so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna launch my iPad now and uh, show you some other features of iOS 7 beta 4 the first thing which I'm gonna show you is the fact that I'm actually running iOS 7 so as you can see out here it says version 11a something something so this is the iOS 7 that I'm running the second and the most important improvement is stability. The iOS 7 is a lot stable, a lot smoother than the previous beta releases and I am sure that Apple is heading towards a successful release this fall to all public. So uh, the next improvement which is a pretty handy one is the notification center. So now what I can do is as you can see there are three tabs in the notification area and I can just use my swipe gestures instead of tapping it all the time. So I can just use my swipe gestures to go back and forth between the different notification area. So that's notification now animations animations are smoother than ever especially the there was a problem with this uh, folder animations on the the bottom bar and now if I tap on productivity it's very smooth it comes in smoothly goes out smoothly and uh, it's pretty handy actually uh, the next thing is a subtle change uh, which is the icons in iOS 7 have some redesign now it's just some color correction but yet it looks very polished the mail and the safari icons looks more polished than ever uh, last but not least uh, uh, you have uh, Siri uh, you know uh, improvements in Siri so what I'm gonna show you is now what is the square root of 52 so it's giving me an answer out here and uh, what Siri does is it also allows you to see related questions but I'm not sure why I can't see that right now so I'm gonna like close Siri for now and Siri has been improved and uh, lastly I'm also going to show you uh, you know uh, this photo photos application uh, which is more smoother than ever so now you have your camera roll and you can like uh, go back to your albums and uh, you know it's pretty smooth and inside your camera roll actually uh, you can uh, just uh, give me a second here uh, you can just uh, select uh, Im images right here and use the share button uh, to share on various social networking websites uh, this is pretty handy and uh, last but not least I am in love with the iOS 7 keyboard and I think the keyboard is brilliant and uh, it's very elegant uh, and uh, you'll thoroughly enjoy it uh, so uh, that's it now uh, uh, thanks for watching my video and I hope you like iOS 7 if you don't have iOS 7 you can either wait or you can either get in touch with me uh, to get a registration so that you can download iOS 7 and this is iOS 7 uh, beta 4 running on my iPad 3 again please subscribe to my video and like my videos and uh, share this channel with others who love iOS and iPad and visit my blog www.thenewipadblog.net where I speak about iOS 7 a lot uh, thanks for watching this video catch you guys later